In this very short video, I'm going to show you how you can prove a very simple trig identity that sec x minus cos x can be written as sine x tan x. And let's look at the definitions that you're going to have to use to be able to prove this. Now, the first thing is that sec x, we want to do something to deal with it. So tan x is sine x over cos x. That's going to be useful. And this sec x is equal to 1 over cos x. And I've color coded those because I'm going to substitute the 1 over cos x into the sec x. And so there's the substitution done. So on the left hand side, I only now have cosines to deal with, and that's going to make things much simpler. So let's look at doing some manipulation of this expression to head towards the proof that we're looking for. So we're going to copy what we had before, and we're going to look at this cos x. Now cos x could be written like this. You've got cos x is cos squared x divided by x, just like x squared divided by x would simplify to x. So we can simply do a straight substitution and replace that. The good thing about this is we now have a common denominator. We've got cos x on the bottom of the fraction that allows this to be combined. So we end up with 1 minus cos squared x on the top. And if you're really thinking you might recognize 1 minus cos squared x from somewhere else. And you might remember that cos squared x plus sine squared x equals 1. And if you rearrange that, you can show that sine squared x is 1 minus cos squared x. So that 1 minus cos squared x can simply be replaced with sine squared x. So we do that simple replacement. Now, the next step is to realize that that sine squared x is the same as sine x times sine x. So I've taken out the sine x and separated that. That sine x over cos x should look familiar. Sine x over cos x is the definition of tan x. So we can replace that sine x over cos x with tan x, and then we get this expression here. And look, it has worked. Both sides are equal to each other, and therefore we have proven this identity. So I hope this video was helpful to you. If it was, please like and subscribe. And finally, thank you very much for watching.